How's it going guys? Iron Stallion here, back with another Destiny 2 video that I'm going to be showing you guys how to one-man the Corrupted Strike. So sit back, relax, and without further ado, let's get this started. Okay, at the start here, just simply start shooting. And you're probably not going to do a lot of damage, even though you spent over a year grinding to have a powerful guardian, so just make sure you don't have a life outside of gaming because we're going to be here a while, ladies and gentlemen. Also, guys, make sure to die here. It is a crucial key part in completing this one man. You will see me dying a lot. That is because it is part of completing this one man. Okay, guys, once you've almost killed everybody, you're going to run into these guys that have the annoying Titan Bubble Ultimate and contemplate the sense as to why they were even given them or why they even have them. <sighs> Last of this mini boss. Do your best to kill him. If you die, it's okay. Because it's part of the one-man guide. But after you do kill him, you'll head up the stairs to be greeted by Shrek and a mess of swamp creatures. Just quickly get rid of him so we can go to the next part. Also, make sure not to die on this one. It's not part of the one-man guide. Next part here, you're going to scan this thing. It's going to prompt a useless, boring conversation, which will then allow you to go through the upside down. By the way, we have gotten this far, so might as well have a little dance. You've earned it. Up ahead, you're gonna be more monsters. Just run past these. You don't have to fight them. They're useless. Then you'll be in this room. <clears throat> okay, um, this room might be the make it or break it. You will have a high tendency to rage quit on reaching this part. So just have patience. Also, you will die a lot. But fear not, because it is part of the one-man guide. So the way this room works is basically grabbing a ball and throwing it to shielded enemies so their shield will go away and allow you to kill them and move on to the next part. Simple. However, this is Bungie, so it's not really over. So basically what they did was revived what you just fought but with the map reskinned. So now, repeat the same process. Live, die, repeat. Just like Tom Cruise in that one movie. Once you complete that, you'll find some more enemies to defeat, and once you defeat them, you'll reach another scanny boy to further this not-so-interesting story. <sighs> mm, yes, can you guess what's coming up next, my good people? Yes, that's right. More monsters. You see, it's here in my Destiny career that I've realized how Bungie doesn't care about me or the game itself. All they give us to challenge the player is spawning a ludicrous amount of enemies with no personal satisfaction after completion. And yes, this realization is part of completing this one man. So, finish the monsters, parkour, a few more monsters, then you shall reach the final part of this strike. Be prepared ye, for a big Chungus is coming, and Chungus has brought an arsenal with him. Automatic turrets, an anchor to drag you, a shield, infinite spawn of enemies, a force push, potential invulnerability, and witches once health has reached a low. However, your savior Iron has found a cheat spot that removes you from any of that harm. Just turn the corner of this cliff and it's right there. All you need now is the patience to defeat Chungus. Once you've defeated Chungus, do a prompt teabag to officially finish this one-man run. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, you've done it. With this guide, you will have the best outcome and fastest time. Now, you can delete this game and never play it again. Rest easy, sweet prince. You've earned it.